boom, bam. Is you a beginner and you're like, I heard Chinese was crazy. Quajo, what book can I use to start and learn the best, the quickest right now? Cause they tell me Chinese is hard and I'm not sure I can make it. Quajo, show me the way. I'm gonna give you the split by split, side by side, play by play comparison. You can head down to the description, buy it on Amazon and just start learning. That's how it works. You gotta climb the mountain. By the way, my name is Quajo, creator here at Elementary Chinese. If you don't know me, if you do know me, welcome back and thanks for watching another book review. Honorary mention goes to Chinesey Every Day. I reviewed it right up there because look, it's just so pretty. Even though there's no audio, which means you don't know how to say the words, it's not truly a beginner book. I think both of these books are all right, but there can only be one winner. And look, they both say Chinese for beginners. You need audio if you're a beginner so you can practice and get your pronunciation right. Audio CD, audio CD. These books are focused on practical content, ordering tea and coffee, asking your way around town, finding a hotel room, introducing yourself, talking about food. See, while a textbook gives you a bunch of grammar, these books are focusing solely on phrases that you can use. Did you subscribe yet? And hit that notification bell so you know when I go live next, you can get your questions answered. So as an absolute beginner, especially one who has not taken classes in a school, university, or online, these books won't overwhelm you. I'm a very visual person. Which one is prettier? You tell me. I made a book guide to help you learn the most with whatever Chinese book you get. It's way down in the descriptions below. BBC Talk or Get Talking Chinese. BBC Talk Mandarin only has pinyin and a few Chinese characters here and there. Get Talking Chinese, also known as Easy Peasy Chinese if you're in the UK. And you wanna know what book I used when I first started studying Chinese? Here's a hint, neither of them. I actually started Chinese when I lived in Paris, France with a book called The Assy Mill Method. It's in French, however, they do have an English version available in Amazon.com. Ding, 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 you win, you the best for beginners. Click or tap the screen right here for a playlist where I review each of these books individually or go down to the descriptions and get the book from Amazon right now because time keeps on slipping, slipping into the future. <laughs> My name's Quajo. Good, good study, day, day up.